It's the busiest travel day of the holiday season. AAA predicts millions of people are driving or flying post-holiday. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Caitlin Francis has more from Bradley International Airport. Christmas is in the rear view, but now the rush to return is on. This is what it looked like at Bradley International Airport early this morning. Long lines, even longer through pre-check, but that quickly changed. I know. I'm very surprised, especially for this airport, because this tends to be a very big travel day because you have so many kids off from school, families that want to travel and or get some vacation time in. So this is actually a lull. Daigle, who works for the airlines, says this week has actually been very busy. It is record numbers. There is not a flight that we have not been full on. We have yet to have open seats and availability. This is the time of year, especially for New England, where a lot of families like to vacation and go to the warmer weather. So we have seen it all. We have seen the people going on cruises, people going to the islands, and people heading out to the West Coast. The Neelands are actually heading to Iowa to see family. Who are we going to visit, my, my grandma and grandpa? They were also surprised to see the airport fairly empty. Actually, it was more finding park the parking. Um, parking. Okay. Yeah, some of the lots were full this morning. They're hoping their trip back will be just as easy, but they came prepared. I have toys and games on my iPad. Despite the quiet morning, officials say this truly has been a busy time and things will remain steady through New Year's. It's been a really great uh, week and we really had great operations across the board. So we've been on time and we've really had the weather to our advantage. Friday is expected to be another busy day here at the airport, so if you're traveling, make sure you pack some extra patience. At Bradley International Airport, Caitlin Francis, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.